Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is another Deke J. Wilson STEM video. Uh, today, I'm going to show you how to create a table of contents and Google Docs. Now, previously, I showed you how to do this in Microsoft Word, but uh, Google Docs also has an equally um, nice way to create a nicely formatted table of contents. And what I'm going to do is I want to leave uh, my first two pages blank. And um, obviously the reason for that is your first page is typically your cover page and then your second page is your table of contents. And so then um, I'm on page number three right now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to type chapter one. Okay. And then after I type chapter one, I'm going to go down. I'm going to create chapter two and chapter three. Okay, so I'm going to insert a page break and then chapter, oops, chapter two and chapter three. And just for uh, those of you who love APA, like myself, I'm going to have a references page. Okay. So now, once I create my chapter headings, I'm actually going to go back to each one of my chapter headings. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to highlight my chapter heading. Okay. And then right here where it says uh, styles, normal text, I'm actually going to change this to a heading style. So I want to change each one to heading number one. Okay, so then I'm going to scroll down, chapter two, change this, heading number one, and chapter three. One, and last and certainly not least, our references, anyone. Now, Obviously, right now, it changed my format to uh, something different. So what I'm going to do is a lot of us in APA know that most of our work needs to be Times New Romans. So I want to change this to Times New Romans. It also has to be size 12. So I'm going to change it to size 12. And now, once I've done that, now I can actually go back to the second page of my document. Remember, your second page is typically for your table of contents. And now I'm going to click on insert and right down here where it says table of contents, I'm going to choose one of these two options. Now, if you notice, this has um, with blue links, what this is, is this is if I want to be able to click on a link to go to that page. And this is, um, well, this is mainly for like web pages, but this is mainly for things that we would print out. So there is my table of contents and actually at the top of this I would type table of contents. Okay. And obviously let me close out my screen of the Romans. Okay. And that's pretty that's pretty easy. Okay. That's all you have to do to create a table of contents in Google Docs. All right. Um, again Please click on subscribe to see more uh, videos from J from DJ Wilson, and uh, hope you got a lot out of this.